Hello, it's Smoothie Saturday. Is that what you guys call it on Saturday? Because you should, because it sounds it sounds really good. Anyways, I'm Eric of Eric's Every New Day, the best channel that starts with Eric's. That might not be true. It, I hope it is, but it might not be. Anyways, Kayla asked me to make a video on Saturday for you guys as a guest vlogger. You can check out my links over there for my, what's over there? YouTube and Twitter. They're over there, so check those out if you want. If you thought this was horrible, then don't. But hopefully you won't think it's horrible. Anyways, I make videos on YouTube over at my channel. I try to make as many videos in a week as I can. I try to aim for five, but I don't think I've done that in quite a while. I typically make like two or three videos a week, so if you like lots of videos and you like to see me a lot, then you should go over there. It's really cool. Anyways, I'm going to be 21 next week, and I'm going to university I'm going to my third university, transferred for the th second time, so I know what I'm doing with my life. I'll be studying film and communication management. So that's a little bit about me. Now I'm just going to do a bunch of the weeks that have been passed. We're going to start with versus week, so I'm going to answer a bunch of the versus questions. Not all of them, but a bunch of them. So here we go. Six or sixteen? Sixteen. Bird or fish? Bird. Peanut butter or jelly? Peanut butter. Ice cream or cake? Ice cream cake. Milk or orange juice? Milk. Morning or evening? Evening. Cats or dogs? I'm going to do it in this order. Small dogs, then cats of any size, and then least favorite is large dogs. Cave or treehouse? Giant treehouse. That would just be so cool. Vampires or werewolves? Werewolves. Mustaches or unibrow? Well, I would look fine with a mustache if I could actually grow one. I haven't shaved my mustache in like two weeks, and this is, this is what I have to show, and you can't even tell. So growing a mustache would actually be really, really good for me. Fears. We're going to do the fear week as well. My biggest irrational fear, I would say, because it's not really, there's no reason behind it, is dark staircases. Not the dark or just staircases. I'm not scared of the dark. Like, if I'm in a dark room, I'm not scared. Dark staircases just freak me out. I don't know why. Probably because my cat used to sleep on my staircase, and I would, like, trip and try to regain balance as I was falling down the stairs. We, we live in a split level home, so there's a lot of staircases. This is the universal sign for staircases, by the way. And so I'd have to like count all the stairs because it was dark when I used to wake up and my cat would sleep on them. So it was just, staircases just kind of freak me out. I always feel someone's watching me and someone's gonna grab me on a staircase as well. I don't know why, they just freak me out. Harry Potter, I'm gonna talk about the movie really quickly. As a movie, it's brilliant. As a Harry Potter movie, if you've never read the books, it's really good. As a Harry Potter movie, if you've read the books, it's still really good, but you have to realize you can't nitpick it to death. Time warp. If I could grow up in any like decade in the past hundred years, I'd like to be like, I'd like to go between five and 15 in the eighties. So I'd be born in like 1975. And then because that's when video games started coming out. And as you'll see later, I really like video games. Culture, I'm a Euro mutt. Each of my eight great grandparents came from a different European country. I know that I'm Transylvanian, Welsh, um, Ukrainian, and German, and then four other things that I can't remember. I associate myself most with Ukrainian because we eat a lot of pierogies, which are very Ukrainian, and we do the Ukrainian Easter eggs, which you've, if you've never seen Ukrainian Easter eggs, Google that and just be amazed by what. I can't do anything near that good, but my aunt and my mom can do beautiful Ukrainian Easter eggs. Geek Week. This is what I was talking about with the video games. You're about to see something I've never shown before in any of my videos. So this is my Nintendo collection. It's a lot of Nintendo stuff. Lunchbox, Thermos. That's an original Game & Watch with the original Mario game on it. All the Beanie Guys, a coloring book, iron-ons, comic books, just random stuff. We got Sonic and Knuckles right there. They're not Nintendo, but still a lot of video game stuff right here on the top of my bookshelf. So if that doesn't prove my geekiness, I really, really don't know what will. That's a lot of Nintendo stuff over there. My bookshelf is that way in my room. Anyways, so that should definitely prove my geekiness. I'll finish up this video with the time travel theme. If I could travel anywhere in time, I would probably go back to like biblical times and like hang out with Jesus and the apostles and guys like that. Because I used to be a Theo major. So I think that'd be kind of cool. So yeah, I've been Eric's Every New Day. I still will be after this video ends. You can find me in the links over there. Thank all of you smoothie people for watching this video. And smoothie girls and smoothie viewers, stay sweet.